guys, I am so excited for this week's videos. I am basing both of my videos this week on Lush. Lush is my absolute favorite store. A lot of you guys already know that. A lot of you guys have asked me to tell you guys what my top favorite Lush products are. And so I thought today for this video I would share with you guys my top four favorite Lush products and then one Lush product that I didn't hate but I didn't love so I probably wouldn't repurchase it and then on Friday I'm going to be giving you guys a sneak peek review of brand new Lush products that are coming out to the stores on July 3rd. So let's get started with my very favorite Lush product. That It was the very first Lush product I've ever bought in and they are my favorite. It is the Lush bath bombs. The bath fizzes, the bath bombs, whatever you want to call it, they are my favorite. I have used the bath soaps or the bubble baths that you put under the water and it makes the bath full of bubbles. My favorite bath product is the bath bombs. Now let me tell you, the stores always say to not break the bath bombs, to use one per use, but I I don't know, I like to break up. I know they say not to do that because if you use the whole bath bomb, it like, there are certain layers and stuff as it's bath fizzing, but I don't really mind it. I kind of like to break it up. But my two favorite bath bombs are the lemon one and the butter ball. The butter ball, holy cow, if it is winter, if you are pregnant, if you need moisturized skin, the butter ball is the best. The next product that I absolutely love, and I actually just got it like a month or two ago, I was wanting to go to Sephora and get one of their face masks. I've heard really good things about it. Like I said, I don't even know the brand, so it must not be that good. But I, I wanted to get it, but it was like $80 for like this little, tiny little pot. And I could not justify that. I like to spend money on my skincare, but for that, I could not do. So I headed over to my Lush store, and I think it was only like 25, 28 bucks. It is called the Mask of Magna Minty. And I have to say it like that or else I won't say it very right. Magna Minty. Magna Minty sounds better. This is one of my favorite products that I have, especially for my skincare lately. I really like to use it once a week and take a bath with it and let it sit and soak on my skin. So this has been one of my favorites. It has it is full of peppermint, which you definitely can feel. If your skin is very sensitive, you may not like this. You might want to ask them for a sample because even on my skin, when it's on, it definitely tingles. Tingles almost the scent of burn, but I hate to use the word burn and skin in the same sentence. It doesn't burn your skin, but it's just so tingly because it does have that peppermint in there. And when the lady sold it to me, she was explaining to me that it kind of is an exfoliant as well. Like you can put it on your skin and rub it into your skin like to wash my face first and then I put this on and not only is it a mask that you put onto your skin but I like to rub it into my skin because it has these little beans in there that will kind of like exfoliate your skin very lightly it's not an intense exfoliant at all my next favorite product is rub 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 shower gel and I normally wouldn't branch out other than my fizz balls but my mom took me there for Easter she took all my sisters there and her and my dad had us all get like an Easter pack Package. So I kind of branched out and got this and I'm really glad that I did. I really like it. I think next time though when I run out of it, I'll probably get the one that has a little bit more stronger beads so it's an actual scrub. This is a very, very light scrub but I do love it and that's why I wanted to add it in my favorites because it is something different and it's something that I really like a lot. The next product is the lip scrub. Now I have seen a whole ton of DIY lip balm scrubs and I've done them and I've never really liked them. Maybe I've always added too much oil to it. It's never been my favorite and so I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna spend like the 10 bucks or so, I'm gonna get the lip scrub and I've had it forever. Like I've had this product for months and months. I only use it like once a week maybe twice a week and it's just nice to have on my counter when I see it it's in a cute little glass pot so this is definitely one of my favorites and lastly I have the tea tree toner water this is the product that I kind of would pass and I probably wouldn't repurchase I went in to get it I went in when I was pregnant and the salesman really sold me on it he said I was gonna love it but to tell you the truth I just feel like it's water. I'm sure it's not. I'm sure it's a really good product. If you guys like it, let me know. It just wasn't my 
favorite product. I don't mind spraying it on for like a refresher actually. I think it's actually meant like after your skincare and then before your makeup, but I actually, if I were if I were to repurchase it again, I would actually repurchase it as a fresh and upper rather than before my makeup actually. So maybe that's what I'll probably use the rest of it for because I like it better to refresh my skin. I know I have the MAC Fix Plus stuff that you can use as a refresher, but if I were to choose between those two to refresh my skin after a couple hours, I would use this. So maybe if you guys wanted to try it out for that, you would like it, but that's what I would use it for and that's what I will use the rest of it for. But if you guys have any other products that you've liked from Lush, let me know because I've pretty much liked everything that I've bought in from there. That is my top favorite Lush products. I hope that you guys enjoyed that. Let me know down below if there's any products that you guys like from Lush. And that is it. I will see you guys on Friday and I will be doing a very detailed Lush review for you guys. Let me know if you like this video and I will see you guys next time. Bye!